Told he is the longest standing high school band teacher in the entire state, and he's celebrating 50 years in the classroom. CBS News Detroit's Luke Laster is on your block in Northville with the story. One, two, three, band, left face. There are lessons he's been teaching now for quite some time. Make sure in the voice that you are really saying pace. The big 5 0. 50 years of education for Northville School's music teacher, Mike Rumbell. Okay, who's that guy? It's the kids that make me come back. And that hasn't changed throughout his career. He's been teaching all aspects of music since the 70s, with yearbook documentation to prove it. He respects everybody, even if everyone doesn't have the same amount of respect for him. Junior drum major Ethan Guida proves Rumbell's lessons stand the test of time. Walking alongside of him in his signature brown hat, we're told is a staple of his daily outfits, iconic as some of the students called it, courtesy of his wife while on a shopping trip. She came upon a hat rack and said, uh, Mike, why don't you try this on? So I tried it and I said, gosh, you look great. Why don't you wear it? Okay, we'll get it. And the rest is history. <laughs> A trombone player by trade, Rumbell's resume includes now 38 trips to the Detroit Jazz Festival alongside Northville band students. Performances with the Julie Andrews Orchestra, Sammy Davis Jr., and countless other experiences dating back decades. With as much time into it that you have, when you hanging it up, do you know? I, I don't have any feeling right now. I, uh, I feel good. Uh, I still enjoy coming to work. Uh, I suppose when it stops doing that, maybe I'll, I'll consider leaving. But right now, um, I, I'm just having a little too much fun. No shortage of fulfillment for musician, teacher, mentor, and hat wearer, Mike Rumbell. In Northville, Luke Laster, CBS News, Detroit.